This fleet equipment unscripted interview is presented by Hendrickson, a leading manufacturer of heavy-duty suspension systems and components to the global commercial transportation industry. Visit hendrickson-intl.com to learn more. Hey everyone, Jason Morgan, Content Director for Fleet Equipment. Welcome to Fleet Equipment Unscripted. I am at the PACAR. Where is it? Right there. The PACAR Innovation Center in Sunnydale, California. We have several Kenworth truck EVs. There's one over there that we're going to be riding in. We got the K270E and the T680E. Uh, we also have some charging infrastructure. I will give you a look here in a minute. Let's uh, take a ride in some trucks and get the lowdown on charging options. So come along. The K270E, along with its K370E bigger brother, can cover applications from class six to eight. It sports up to a 35,000 pound GVWR, the option of either a 355 HP or 459 HP motor, and is configurable up to 100, 150, or 200 mile range. The CCS1 DC fast charger enables a one to two hour recharge time depending on the battery pack and charger kilowatt size. Battery pack options are a 141 or 282 kilowatt battery pack. Dana supplies the electric powertrain. The wheelbase options are 206 inches, 218 inches, 270. The ride was comfortable and quiet. Though as we covered before, there's still a bit of a learning curve when learning to drive EVs, especially in the regenerative braking capabilities that sends energy back to the batteries as you take your foot off the pedal. It's an excellent feature that offered powerful braking force, but it did have me stopping about a car's length sooner than I thought it would, given my habits from driving traditional internal combustion engine vehicles. It's not a con by any means, but definitely something drivers will have to get used to. Kenworth's Class 8 electric truck offering is the T680E. It has gross vehicle weight rating offerings of 54,000 pounds or 82,000 pounds. Now you might be saying 82,000 pounds, there's actually a federal exemption uh, for electric vehicles up to 82,000 um, pounds because of the weight of the batteries. Uh, so you can get it for up to 82,000 uh, pounds. It sports 670 horsepower of peak power uh, in an approximate 150 mile range and with the CCS1 DC fast charge, it makes about a three hour charge time possible, again, depending on the battery pack and charger kilowatt size. It utilizes a 396 kilowatt hour battery pack. Meritor supplies the electric powertrain for the Class 8 vehicle and the electric powertrain is built on the existing T680 body and product platform uh, that you'd recognize from the diesel world. For more on the charging options that Packard is offering, I called up with Daryl Oster, Chief Engineer Zero Emissions with Packard, who walked me through the equipment. Well, we've got a Packard charger, just a display model here, but basically it's a two dispenser charger and uh, we offer Packard chargers from a variety of 20 kilowatts to 350 kilowatts, some okay. with multiple dispensers that can service two trucks right now. So okay. that's some of our initial offering. Um, this charger here has the two dispensers, oh, yeah, and okay. then we've got the CCS Type 1 combo charger connector here, which is the standard plug that we're putting on our electric vehicles so okay. right now that we're, we're launching into production. Right. So, uh, you know, we offer these available for sale through Pack Our Parts, through our TRP store, as well as through our truck brands, Kenworth and Peterbilt today. Right. So customers can partner with us. And Chargers is really part of our overall ecosystem, our go-to-market strategy, where we offer vehicles for sale, we offer the chargers, we offer support through our partners with um, Entech and right. Schneider. Right. For the, it's basically the easy button for the customer. It's a one-stop right. shop. We can we can provide the products, the services, the installation, the technical expertise, as well as financing for the customers. So right. We can really meet all their needs through PACAR. Right. Okay. So it's all wrapped up in PACAR Financial. Um, are there any? So and this is uh, uh, forgive me. This is new to me too. So this is a DC charger, right? Yeah, so this correct. would be faster charging. Uh, you mentioned up to up to three hundred up to three hundred fifty, which is pretty fast. I think faster than most fleets are putting in at this point too. So there's some scalability in the future there, right? Exactly, and really the three fifty, which is coming out this year, is is suited for multiple trucks. And so you know you divide that by two with two dispensers, you can put one hundred seventy five kilowatts into the vehicle. And, and there's right, some limitations okay. on how much energy the vehicle will take that the batteries can take at any given time. But most of the charger offerings are DC fast, mm -hmm. um, from 50 kilowatts all the way up to 350 with increments from like 50 to 
120, 150, 175, 350. Uh, we do offer a couple smaller solutions. We call them a wall box or a mobile right. 20 kilowatt charger. So if you got a, a level two capability in your shop and you want to plug in a mobile charger, they can roll around and plug into the wall. Okay. To slow charge, if you got lots of time or just service shop or whatever, we offer right. that, that option as well. Very cool. Excellent. Thank you.